South Korea began voting Wednesday in local elections and parliamentary by-elections. These elections are seen as a referendum on Liberal President Moon Jae-in's administration. A stake of 4,016 local administrative, legislative, and educational posts, including 17 metropolitan mayoralities and provincial governorships. The by-elections are to fill 12 vacant parliamentary seats. The voting runs for 12 hours from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. at about 14,000 polling centers nationwide. According to the National Election Commission, or NEC, the eligible voters number 42.9 million. As of 3 p.m., the voter turnout rate reached 50.1 percent, of 4.1 percentage points from four years ago. The reading includes the 20.14 percent of voters who cast their ballots in two-day early voting last week. The early voting showed higher-than-expected turnout. Now the media's attention is to whether the overall rate for the local elections could reach the 60% mark for the first time since 2010. The turnout rate for the 2014 local elections came to 56.8%, while the turnout for early voting in those elections was 11.5%. The ruling Democratic Party, or DP, is widely expected to clinch a sweeping victory on the back of a strong public support for Moon and his drive for peace with North Korea. At the same time, rival parties have been gauging the impact of the historic summit between U.S. President Donald Trump and North Korean leader Kim Jong-un, which was held just a day earlier in Singapore. I'm Joan Chung, Yanam News.